please. I know about criminal solicitation. But in this case, it simply doesn't apply. It's not the intent of the statute. Listen again. A person is guilty of criminal solicitation if he commands, induces, entreats, or otherwise attempts to persuade another person to commit a felony. You can read it to me till you're blue in the face. I am not going to let you prosecute a bunch of spectators. They're not spectators. They solicited the rape. Do you really want to go into court and ask a jury to lock up a bunch of people for clapping and cheering? Clapping, cheering, pushing, goading, getting the rape going and keeping it going. What happens if you lose? You'll look like an incompetent. If you win, you'll look like a vengeful bitch. Either way, you hurt yourself and you hurt this office. Now drop it. You've got more important things to do. No, I haven't. You haven't got more important things to do than go to trial with a sure loser? What the hell has gotten into you? We owe her. Owe her what? We put the rapists away. I owe her. I see. You want to spend my money to put a bunch of spectators on trial. A trial you'll lose because you owe her. No! You don't get to use this office to pay your debts. No! I am going to try this case and you're not going to stop me. I'm not. Catherine, you're an ace. You've got a great future. Don't put it in jeopardy. What are you going to do, fire me? Go right ahead. My first case will be a civil suit against the rapists, the solicitors, the bar, and the state. And I will show that Sarah Tobias wound up in the hospital because this office sold her out. I will subpoena your records, put you on the stand, and cross-examine you on every sleazy plea bargain this office ever made. All right, you go try your case. You have a good time! Because win or lose, you're through! What are you looking at? Get back to work! 